Hi everyone! In this SmartyPad tutorial, we will go through the beginning coding category, both explore mode and play mode. This content has been vetted by educators to ensure a comprehensive learning experience while aligning to standard curriculum. Although you can change categories when the device is on, for the purpose of this tutorial, we will go ahead and set the learning category switch to beginning coding and set the mode selection switch to explore mode before we turn it on. Now let's go ahead and power on the Smarty Pad using the power switch on the underside of the device. In the explore mode of beginning coding, SmartyPad will teach you the basics of coding and running a sequence. Let's learn the basics of coding! The objective is to code the path that moves the green square to the red square. On the lower portion of the interactive display, you will see a directional pad with a green square in the middle. This directional pad does not change and functions as your programming pad. It works as follows. Pressing on white programs the playing square to move right one square. Pressing on red programs the playing square to move down one square. Pressing on blue programs the playing square to move left one square. Pressing on yellow programs the playing square to move up one square. Pressing on green runs your coded sequence. Above the directional pad on the upper portion of the interactive display, you will see a maze with the green square and red square. After each maze is completed, a different one appears. Essentially, there are three ways to go about this. You can program one square at a time, which is the least efficient method. Let's go! Look harder! You can do this! Let's go! Look harder! You can do this! You can program one segment at a time, which is more efficient, but not most efficient. You can program the entire path in one shot which is the most efficient method. Down. Left, 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 left. Down, down. Right, 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 right. Up, go. Now let's move the mode selection switch to the play mode while still in the beginning coding category. The first game in the beginning coding category is called Color Tag. Let's play Color Tag! In this game, SmartyPad asks you to tag a specific color with the green square. To do this, code the path of the green square using the directional pad on the bottom of the interactive display. The goal is to code the most efficient route that eliminates all of the instructed color using the least number of steps. Let's give it a try together. Move the green square around the screen to tag the squares as instructed. Tag all the yellows.
Now press the next button to move to the second game in the beginning coding category. This game is called Escape Room. This game uses Smarty Pad's motion sensing technology. The goal is to keep the lit square in play on the interactive display. To do this, use the tilting function of your Smarty Pad to move the paddle left, right, up, and down to connect with the moving square. It is essential that whenever you are playing a game that uses motion detection, that the device is held parallel to the floor. Only then will it operate correctly. Also, this game gets progressively more challenging as you advance, causing the lit square to move faster. Let's do a few rounds together. Let's play escape room. Don't let the little green square get out of the big square box. Ready to play escape room? Here we go. Now let's press the next button to go to the third and final game in the beginning coding category. This game is called Amazing. This game uses Smarty Pad's motion sensing technology. The goal is to move the lit square from one end of the maze on the interactive display to the other. To do this, tilt your Smarty Pad in the direction you want the square to move. It is essential that whenever you are playing a game that uses motion detection, that the device is held parallel to the floor. Only then will it operate correctly. Let's give it a shot together. Let's play Amazing! Tilt your Smarty to move the green square from one end of the maze to the other. Try tilting your Smarty screen to see what happens. <laughs> That completes our demo of all of the activities in the beginning coding category. Make sure to check out the other SmartyPad videos for more tutorials.